wide brush strokes and bold colours that sweep across the canvas. Bernard Fries's paintings almost feel as though if you reached out to touch them, you'd feel a delicate fabric rather than paint. At the same time, Fries's paintings are structured precise geometrical patterns, but somehow with more depth than simply a carefully repeated motif. But what Fries has created here is a body of work that represents for him the fabric of society and his own struggle to reconcile his interactions with it. The conflict between his political views and his chosen occupation. I was very cl close to um, uh, extreme, re extreme left political groups and uh, this uh, political activity seemed to me very far from uh, painting alone in, in, a, in a studio and, and delivering a painting which uh, responds to a certain class of people. So I could not find the, the link be between the, those things. And, uh, and the way I, I tried to resolve it was to, in the work, to find a very simple way to work, like, like uh, I would be a worker, let's say like I uh, would not be different from the other, not deliver uh, uh, a personal expression. He says his own feelings and emotions don't belong in his art. What matters for him is the act of painting. The emphasis is very much on the process and production of the work rather than the resulting visual elements like colour and composition. His aim may be to create something simple, but the motivations behind his work are complex. If we were able to uh, not describe it, but to explain it, I mean, there, there would be no reason to paint. I, I don't want to say, oh, this means this, and that, that, you know, because painting is not working like this. Bernard Fries's work is like looking at fabric fibres under a microscope. The initial complexity he attributes to the work becomes simple, repetitive patterns. Kerry Alexandra, TRT World, Istanbul.